Dr. Gilmore, what are the biggest reasons the global food system will experience unprecedented pressure over the next half century? I think first and foremost, uh, the main concern is will supply be able to satisfy demand requirements? The demographics are uh, projecting out to the year 2050 population growth and numbers around 9 billion people. That's a lot of mouths to feed and in addition uh, if uh, some of these areas show growth rates with uh, changing consumer preferences which require higher protein levels that will require higher pro uh, uh, production capabilities, particularly in the bulk commodities like uh, the grains and wheat and staple food items. So the demands on the supply chain are likely to, uh, to be greater and that I think is a concern that is shared by uh, practitioners as well as by analysts. I'd add another thing and that of course is the concern over climate change. Uh, with uh, the likelihood that uh, we have a changing planet, the question is where, uh, uh, what will that impact be on our crops, our yields, and again that impacts the supply projections over time. What is the importance of public-private partnerships in promoting market development and increasing food availability and access? I think that public-private partnerships are an ideal means to leverage resources. And given the fact that uh, the developed economies are uh, just coming out of a recessionary, or we hope are coming out of recessionary uh, trends, uh, makes the, uh, the need to leverage resources that much greater. In addition, I think that public-private platforms uh, marry the skills of the public sector with the, uh, with the technical skills and management uh, capabilities of the private sector. What is the biggest danger to achieving the solutions you have proposed for sustainable food growth? Probably, in my view, the biggest danger is uh, declining resources, slow growth, slower growth rates, uh, and, um, prop and the continual uh, risk uh, management issues that surround government's considerations in, in uh, countries and regions around the world. Thank you very much, Dr. My pleasure.